night. How did this, you know, start off for you? Um, the nostalgic. I, I had started content way back. Mm. Uh, I was doing a bit of everything. You know, before you find your footing, yes, before yes. even any brand looks at you, you're trying beauty. Uh-huh. You're trying, especially if, uh, for me, not to brag, I'm yes. multi-talented. Like, I can do... Hello. Life. Okay. <laughs> I like it. Uh-huh. Beauty and lifestyle. I can be funny. Yes. So, I used to do everything until one day I was on TikTok. I came across the Mr. Nice audio. Mm-hmm. And I was like, ah, this reminds me, like I, I, it reminded me of a certain time in my own life. Right. And so I told my own story uh-huh. as I did the content. Yes. I thought it was only me who uh-huh. was going to relate and maybe 10 others we grew up together. <laughs> yes, just 10. <laughs> but you <laughs> were surprised. 10. You were very surprised. I post the video, mind my business, come back later. And it seems like we all went to the same school, the same, we grew up in the same village or Man. something. Yeah. And um, so for me, I'd say it wasn't planned. It was very like, oops. It was mm-hmm. oops. Yeah, mm-hmm. I found myself there. I mean, I think that was the time you blew up. Yes. That's when people now knew Mimo Karanja. You started getting the following. Absolutely. was massive. Yeah. What is going through your mind right now? I'm going to be a millionaire. <laughs> I'm going to be famous. <laughs> what exactly is going through your mind as you see all these numbers coming in? Um, For me, because as I said, like when I posted the video, I went off. Mm-hmm. Uh, um, that day we had visitors Kwanzaa at yes, home. Yes. So I was busy. Uh-huh. And then I go back. It was even on Twitter. Like it went mad viral on mm. everyone's WhatsApp. And and I was like, I think this is the break I was hoping for for like two years now. Wow. Since I had started like now being consistent on t- um on as a content creator. Right. I had not got any new gig. Oof. So I was like if this is not it, I, then this is not for me. <laughs> this is not for me. I have to just accept that it will never work out. And so what that video did is for me, I'd say in as much as I was doing content creation before, it mm-hmm. gave me my place in this space yes. of content creation. It's kind of unique as well. Yes, yes. I mean, it, you've it created uh-huh. a demand. Ah. Like, yes, it created a demand on that content. So. And it's always a lot of you. There's quite a number. Are these like buddies? Are these like childhood friends? Mm-hmm. As it's, uh, are they like neighbors? Yeah. You do content with all these guys? Um, mostly I do content on my own, but mm-hmm. now I collaborate with other people that I've come to know f- in the industry. Yes. Um, so that has also enabled me maybe to interact with others and maybe get new audiences through their platforms. Oh, fantastic. Yeah.